G'day, I'm Jack Murphy, playing coach of the Stuttgart Giants. I'm going to talk you through how to kick a drop punt set shot at goal. So the first thing you want to look at is your grip and your hand placement on the ball. I always like to go for, for three on the front panel, one down the seam and one on the back panel, both sides to make sure you have a nice loose grip on the ball. You then need to know your distance to the player on the mark, that you don't get too close. So I always count back my steps from the player on the mark so that I know exactly how many steps I've got to take during my run up in order to kick the goal. Critically important with a set shot at goal is that your body is facing towards your target. You'll see a lot, often players when they miss left or right, if you watch a replay, their hips might be facing also in that direction. So I always practice quick bend over and I check with my ball placement that when I lift it straight up, it's pointing directly through the goals. And then I know that my whole body's facing towards the goals. The last thing is to have a very relaxed approach. You want to kick the ball nice and cleanly off the back portion in the lower quarter. And you want to not overkick it. You want to have a nice clean follow through. So once you've set your grip, you've got your distance, your body's all straight at the target. You want to have a nice relaxed approach a few easy walk steps, a few jog steps. That's how you kick a drop punt goal.